The human body is a fascinating machine. To achieve true holistic wellness, it helps to educate yourself. How can you take care of yourself and your body if you don't know how your body works? People who study anatomy study the body, how it is made up and how it works. The first documented scientific dissections on the human body are carried out as early as the 3rd century BC in Alexandria. Anatomy is a complex and dynamic field that is constantly evolving as new discoveries are made. Organs are the body's recognizable structures, for example the heart, lungs, liver, eyes and stomach, that perform specific functions. An organ is made of several types of tissue and therefore several types of cells. Organs also function together in groups, called organ systems. There's the respiratory system. The lungs are the major organs of the respiratory system, which helps provide the body with a continuous supply of oxygen. The lungs take more than 6 million breaths per year and affect every aspect of our bodies and health. The cardiovascular system. The cardiovascular system consists of the heart, blood vessels, and blood. Its primary function is to transport nutrients and oxygen-rich blood to all parts of the body and to carry deoxygenated blood back to the lungs. The nervous system. Your nervous system plays a role in everything you do. The three main parts of your nervous system are your brain, spinal cord, and nerves. Your body's command center, helping you move, think, and feel. It even regulates the things you do but don't think about like digestion. The digestive system. Your digestive system is a network of organs that help you digest and absorb nutrition from your food. These organs include the mouth, pharynx or throat, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum, and anus. The digestive system also includes the salivary glands, liver, gallbladder, and pancreas, which make digestive juices and enzymes that help with digestion. The lymphatic system. The lymphatic system is a network of vessels, nodes, and ducts that pass through almost all bodily tissues. It allows the circulation of a fluid called lymph through the body in a similar way to blood. It is part of the immune system. The urinary system. The urinary system's function is to filter blood and create urine as a waste byproduct. 
The organs of the urinary system include the kidneys, renal pelvis, ureters, bladder, and urethra. The reproductive system. The tissues, glands, and organs involved in producing offspring, children. In women, the reproductive system includes the ovaries, the fallopian tubes, the uterus, the cervix, and the vagina. In men, it includes the prostate, the testes, and the penis. The muscular system. The muscular system comprises skeletal, smooth, and cardiac muscles, functioning to enable body movement, support posture, and circulate blood. The musculoskeletal system, consisting of the muscular and skeletal systems, is accountable for body movement. The skeletal system. The skeletal system is made up of the bones that give structure to the human body. Bones protect and support vital organs and work with muscles to help the body move. Bone marrow is the soft inner part of many bones of the body. The immune system. The immune system is the body's tool for preventing or limiting infection. Its complex network of cells, organs, proteins, and tissues enable the immune system to defend the body from pathogens. The endocrine system. The endocrine system is a complex network of glands and organs. It uses hormones to control and coordinate your body's metabolism, energy level, reproduction, growth and development, and response to injury, stress, and mood. The integumentary system. Your integumentary system is your body's outer layer. It consists of your skin, hair, nails, and glands. These organs and structures are your first line of defense against bacteria and help protect you from injury and sunlight. Subscribe to join us on a journey through the human body.